Hello everybody, this is Armin R. Laird, super fan, and welcome back to Let's Play Yoshi's Woolly World. In the last episode, we took a stroll down a rainbow road with... And we also defeated a cheating, lying little chick boss. So in this episode, first off, we switch to Miss Cluck the Yoshi. And now we're going to head over to... World 4. There's going to be an extra video at the end explaining what all this crap is. The Amiibo Hut is a fun place if you've got um, Smash Amiibos, which I have. I think I have four of them. I have. I have Roy, Ike, Marth, and Peach. But this isn't Smash, this is Yoshi, Yoshi's Woolly World. So we'll jump right into. Level 4-1, monkeying round and round. That's right, it's exactly what it sounds like. Do you remember those annoying little pains in the neck? Well, they're here. It's a nice jungle theme, and look, there's a rope. If you jump towards the rope, Yoshi will automatically grab onto it. You can climb up and down the rope. And there is an ukiki. You cannot swallow them. But you can spit them out and then jump on them to kill them. Little bastards. Let's start out by grabbing some yarn balls. And also there are ukikis who throw bombs. So they can be very annoying. I'm gonna eat you off that rope and use you to kill your friend. And if you don't step on them after they fall on the ground, they will get up and run away. What are you? There's no way to get up there, that is, until you hit this winged cloud. Also, you wanna hover across, uh, climb across these ropes because right there is your first flower. Hidden behind a giant. Green cube. Come here. You can go kill your friend and then I will step on you. Maybe not? Okay. <laughs> that was kind of weird. Also, your first Wonder Wool. I'd imagine this Yoshi is going to be very green. Also, the red ropes, the, um, the spools cause the ropes to go up and down. Get over here. Oh, wow. Did that Ukiki just bomb his own friend? Brutal, man. No, just no. Obviously, there's something up there. Or else they wouldn't have a rope up there. Well, maybe they would so they could have that guy throwing crap at you. But anyway, we have a pipe that we have to knit together and... Hey. He did bomb his own friend. Don't even... Don't even think about dropping bombs on me, man. You hurt me. Get back here. I'm mad. Uh, let's see, there's Wonder Wool here. And I wasn't paying attention, but I believe there are stamp patches here. I don't know. You're back. Nope. I won't let you throw a single bomb at me. Give me a ride, little blue rope. Give me a ride to the next rope. I'm not going to forget that ledge that's over there. Which has two stamp patches and your second flower. I really like that they have ropes because weren't ropes in Super Mario World? Correct me if I'm wrong, please. You're just waiting for me. Oh, okay. End up stepping on your head. Be careful. Always check behind the place you're supposed to go. Because more than like more likely than not, they will hide crap there that you will miss if you're not careful. You, I'm gonna turn you into a heart. 
And here we have another um, no ground pound zone. The Ukiki's bombs will destroy the sponge. Also, if you spit an Ukiki at the sponge, it'll destroy one, one square of the sponge and die. <laughs> also, you can spit them into wing clouds. Don't even dare. That one can be a little tough if you're not jumpy like I am. Is there anything even up there? Like, can I even get up there? Apparently I can. Let's do some non-stop flutter. Come here, you. Come here, you little bastard. Stop running away from me. Okay. Or you could commit suicide in a pit. You're back. Get over here. You could swallow them in other Yoshi's, uh, Yoshi, Yoshi's Island games, but... Oh yeah, and there we have the ones that are spitting watermelon. You can actually steal the watermelon. It's an already been chewed on watermelon, so you don't get enough... You don't get as many seeds. Just be... Ow! Careful with your watermelon spitting here. That was really stupid of me. Stop. Did they hide anything up there? I don't know. Always leave it to the game developers to make you paranoid about everything. Do I have seeds in my mouth? I do have seeds in my mouth. Oh no, the watermelon fell. At least I knocked the Okiki down. Also, you need to get up on this ledge and up in this pipe before that Okiki spits seeds and blocks your way. In this room, I would recommend just sitting here for a moment and letting the Okikis clear the way for you. I stole your watermelon. And I'm gonna knock you down because you're a jerk. There is a watermelon there. In case you somehow screw up. Is there anything else hidden in here? Just bash and sponge with Yoshi's head. Give poor Yoshi a concussion. No. I think that's everything. It's nice that they have a second watermelon. As I said earlier. Like, five seconds ago. You know. You're not spitting those watermelon. Oh, hi. Apparently there's a winged cloud. I don't remember these uh, later levels as much as I do the first three worlds. No. No. They're just standing there with their watermelon. Can you give me one of those, please? Okay, I stole one. I want to find out what's in here. Oh, some hearts that are going to get away. That was rude. That was very rude, actually. Is there anything hidden over there? No. Let's get out of here. Oh yes, that's right. We have a little rope segment here. With Ukiki, so we'll spit seeds at you. I stole your watermelon. What are you going to do? I'm going to spit a watermelon seed up your ass. How do you like that? Whoa, that was uncomfortably close. I'm getting a little bit nervous here. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Considering how... Considering how terribly I've been doing with pits. Are you hearts? Thank you. I have a feeling there's another Ukiki up ahead. Oh, please don't climb down that rope, Yoshi. Gotcha before you can even spit your damn seeds at me. Oh, he did spit one seed. All the stamp patches. And is that all the Wonder Wool up there? Yeah, that's the, that's the last Wonder Wool. Let's 
get out of here. Oh, we get to play the bonus game. Yay. Yeah, it looks like I was right with my speculations earlier. If you get... If you grab a flower at the end of the... Uh, at the gold ring, you get three beadworks. And an ordinary bead will just get you one. 20 hearts, five flowers, five wonder wool, and all 20 stamp patches. 100% yay. We never have to come back here again. You can usually 100% the first level of a world pretty, pretty quickly. The teeter log one. Let's try not to do so bad like I did last time. Melon, give me that melon. You can also lick up the the beads if I hadn't if I haven't said that earlier. Also, those teetering logs. Uh, I don't think they actually fall. Oh, no, wait, that one on the top right did fall. So, go prove me wrong, game. A little orange yarn ball rolling by. And now it's a green one. Wait, how come I don't have any Meavers posts? That's weird. Maybe people just aren't very chatty right now. Let's see who we needed back together. I'd imagine it would be... A jungle Yoshi. So we'll switch to him and then hop into... Oh god, that level. I hate that level. I hate it. I just... I hate everything having to do about it. See? Just the title alone makes me shudder. Lakitu Peekaboo. <sighs> Let's get this crap over with. There's a certain area where you can easily mess things up. Because, well, I'll talk about it when, when we get there. Also, the first segment is auto-scrolling. Don't worry, this is like the only auto scroll section in the game, I believe. What's that? Oh, and there are Lakitu's throwing shit at you in this auto scroll segment. There's your Wonder Wool. Oh, go away. That's right, the Lakitu's respawn. Don't step on that. Get down there, Yoshi. Because if you. Step on that block, it will fall. What's this? Oh, I barely got that there. Don't care, don't care. Just want to survive here. Why do I keep pressing weird buttons? No. You're not throwing shit at me. I believe this is the last... Yeah, and I think I got everything for this. Oh, he, I got him with the yarn ball. These guys constantly respawn. So, ugh, get out of my way. Don't get out of the way. Don't get in the way of me trying to throw things. I know there's a winged cloud hidden here somewhere. There it is. Don't even. This is really hectic here. Stop it. That one has a door. Let's get the hell out of here. Can I have a checkpoint, please? Because, you know, I... I kind of don't want to do this again. You, go away. Also... Is he really going to try and throw, throwing things at me from up there? Or from down there? 
Is this a section where you have to be careful where you ground pound or how you ground pound things? No. Just no. Oh, okay, I messed up there. What you need to do is come on, come back. Jump off this guy's head and use the flutter boost to get into that pipe. It actually just takes you in here. Where there are just beads, apparently? Mm, okay. Guess if the game really wants to do that. I see you hiding in the wall there. And I don't appreciate it. There's a shy guy just minding his own business. And I'm going to destroy his life. You. <sighs> I hate you guys. Let's see. I know there's a place here. There it is. Down there where that... Down there where there's a violet color... Violet, purple, whatever you call it. There's a bow. Do not miss that. Or you will be very angry at yourself because you'll just pound right past that and then you'll be angry because you're like, Oh, seriously? You. No. Okay, the door's on that side, but what's on the right? Wonderwool, and stop coming back. I'm not over there. What a dumbass that guy is. Okay, I think that's all we need in this room. Ah, yes, checkpoint, thank you. The jungle Yoshi's wheels are like yellow. Just like Kirby turns into a car, Yoshi's... Oh god. This is where I'm gonna die. I will say that right now. I will probably die a few times in this area. Like right there. See, what did I tell you? I think there's enough hearts for you to redeem yourself if you screw up like that. Also, now I don't have any yarn balls. So... This is gonna suck a little bit. Because you do need at least one yarn ball. Okay, there. You're supposed to go that way. Let's see if I can get over there. Climb these really quickly. Climb that. Get out of the way. Whew. Got it on my second try. Thank goodness they put a checkpoint here. See, there's light streaming down from up there. Hmm, I wonder why. Grab some yarn balls, even though you don't really, don't really need to, because you have countless Lakitu's you can put in your mouth. You. Get out of there. You need to throw yarn balls carefully. And that is not carefully. Okay, that's some hearts. Did I mess things up? Did I mess things up already, really? Whoa, how did that guy not hurt me? Okay. Um... What am I doing? You guys need to go away, because you're really pissing me off. I need to n not destroy that sponge there. Because, okay, this is one of them, I think. I need to jump around here. Oh, I think this is one of them. Yes, it makes a door spawn. This is why you need to be careful not to destroy too much sponge. Because if you destroy the sponge below the door, you won't be able to get in there. Oh my god. Okay. If you're quick, you can 
eat them before they uh, before they end up throwing shit at you. I think that's it for this room. But anyway, you notice how there's a Wonder Wool down there? Yep, they did it again. It's down here. Oh my, did I just, did I really do that? Wait a minute, wait a minute, I don't think I'm screwed. This level's very annoying. Let's see, if I stand on here, yes, I can still get in there. Just have one of these guys. Hey, that's all the Wonder Wool. And are there seriously no stamp patches in here? I'm gonna step on your head. Interesting. You, up there, maybe guarding something. Are you guarding something? Maybe not. Maybe it's just an annoying lack of two and a hole for you. Go. Okay, I'm not quite sure what happened there. Pass through the guy without him hitting me? Let's see. Why did I do that? Now I gotta go all the way through here again. Well, avoiding getting shot at. So, there you go. Do not jump on that arrow. Let's see. Oh yeah, over here we have a false block. That makes a big bouncy ball. I think I'm just being paranoid. Armin, stop. Just get out of the level. Just leave. I keep thinking there's like a winged cloud hidden somewhere. Wait a minute. Aha! That's what I was looking for. Also, make sure you line yourself up perfectly or else you'll miss out on those stamp patches. But I think... Okay. I'm missing one of them. Wait a sec. It's right there. You have some falling blocks to jump across. Okay, we made it out of Lakitu's hellhole. Lakitu peekaboo my ass. It's like a Lakitu asshole squad. 20 hearts. Five flowers. Five wonder wool. And 20 stamp patches. We don't have to come back to this stupid level again. Thank you. See? That's weird. Maybe, like, the Nintendo network is down or something? That was a door. And there's a blue button. And a green button. And I wonder... Yep, they went there. They made a lack of two, Yoshi. But and, and as much as I don't like him, I did say that I was going to use each Yoshi color, so... Let's not be rude. But anyway, that was two episodes. There, that was two levels. So... It's time to say goodbye, sadly. But this is Armin Arler, super fan. And I hope you tune in next time for Let's Play Yoshi's Woolly World.